I just want to touch on the Madoff question here because sure. I'm, I'm, and the only question I want to ask about that is, you know, what's fascinating to me, observing that from a distance is, mm -hmm. in any couple, you you know, always the most charged conversations are about money, right? But how did you and Kira navigate that? Well, look, we we've been through a situation already because we've been married for a really long time. And in our relationship, I made all the money and then she got on the closer and I wasn't making jack shit. And for seven years, she made all the money. So we already had this kind of like, there was a certain sort of balance about that whole issue. Even if, I think we were pretty cool about it from the beginning, but even if we weren't, like that really made a, a great balance. And I think that when the Madoff thing happened, we didn't want to sell our apartment and we didn't want to sell, you know, whatever. But we knew we could, you know, we'd be all right. We knew we were going to have each other and uh, that our kids were okay. They were, you know, through school and, you know, almost. We both felt like we would work. And there were so many people that got hit so much harder than us. And, yeah, I mean, I, I don't think there was a moment where that thing happened and then we got pissed at each other. It just, that's, that's just, it was, it was sort of the opposite. We kind of went, holy shit, you know, let's, um, you know, let's, <laughs> I don't know, let's, I don't know. Have sex or something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's free. <laughs> it's free. <laughs>